right starting Sabrina's screen uh, icon is blinking still good old blue breathing throughout the blinking of Adidine screen Welcome back to the gameplay of Rumu. So last time we left this episode, we were actually brought in the night time of day 4, I presume? But I'm not entirely sure as well because, uh, well, Sabrina Club as well made up this uh, whole day number and without me noticing. So, that's still a mystery to me. And I was being awake in the attic with some objects to be found there and uh, there were David Standy, the waffle maker machine and the fax machine as well. So that was pretty interesting. Oh. I am the finest work. My mouse was not responding. Laundry hamper this book I'd say is still the same. I'm not gonna bother to read them. And then a plan to water as usual. Uh, David and Cecily. The teacup. And then this too. I love Sabrina's sense of adventure. Happy times with bites. Octave flakes. Still don't know whose shoes these are. The icon fading in guitar that I don't think we're going to use until the end of the day. New York United Airlines and this thing. That I think we're meant to get in the previous day, but for some reason, before I could access the unknown, it, it's still there already. I think it's been kind of up a bug because uh, it's been like this since uh, I don't know the beginning of day three or something when I discovered uh, Sabrina's computer uh, before I entered day three and discovered the that particular option right there. So yeah, it's gonna be fun. All right, nothing to check on the journal. Still the same as before. Along with the objectives, still in the existent objectives. This is recording. We can start right now. Consciousness online. Affection assigned at 0.91% of capacity. Point. Day 5 reactivation sequence complete. Good morning, Rumu. Morning. And this one is especially glorious. Very important work to be done today. If you would accompany me, we are going to clean the main laboratory. Oh. Your human relationships are moving to a new developmental stage, Rumu. David and Cecily trust you, despite never having met you. Hmm. I love human development. Not this. I will never pick this, I don't think. Who knows, I'll, dis I'll discover it in Discover the Unchosen. A uh, special episode that I've been planning in my head, like for the past in and Rumu. But I mostly love human development. Well, human is arguable in your case. Yeah, I know. Humans generally tend away from affection as they age. Oh. She's not wrong, actually. As we grow older, it's true. But Rumu, I believe, will never stop not loving people. Well, apparently we're going to go to the main lab, huh? That's uh, something, Sabrina. Can I at least go to the kitchen or something? No, I don't need to go to the uh, main lab. And a plan to water. Awesome. Yeah. No more of 
this, we already solved the, solved the puzzle, so it's not shown there again. So no access to foyer, no access to courtroom, the room that I, Ada was in, in day 3, or was it day 2? Oh wait, it's day 2, sorry. I regret to inform you, again, that David and Cecily are absent. Hmm. Hmm. I know at this point they're not in the house anymore because uh, 12 years, 12 years. Mobile maker machine is not lying. Shall I say I trust Sabrina? Or should I say I trust not Sabrina? Because when I say I trust not Sabrina, I think by that point, I have a feeling that the mind lab access will be locked to us. So, I don't think I'm gonna take the risk. Interesting music. I am happy to hear it. If you trust me, you are safe with me, Rumu. Always safe. Mm. Nevertheless, I have been asked to pass on a message. Okay. They say they simply could not live without you. I love picking down barriers. We are entering a new stage of our relationship, too. Mm. By now, you have some notion of the importance of David and Cecily's work. The two most brilliant minds in the field of smart technology. And yet, so very clumsy. Hmm. I love clumsy humans. I love important work. I love clumsy humans. <laughs> well, precisely. If they were faultless, then what would our purpose be? Yeah, good point. Clean the powder mess, you're out of one. I could just go there if I want to, but uh, I have this to discover. Also, yeah, that's the powder mess right there. Oh no, what have I brought to myself? Oh, oh wait, wait, can I climb? Okay, I can climb through here. Good, good. Testing room. What's this? It's not a sign into the name for some reason. What's this? Oh, I can spin at this or talk at this. Oh, whoops. Right. All right. Okay, I'm gonna access there first. Sorry, Rumu. I probably should. I probably should go, go down with, uh, from the ramp thing. Lab terminal A, anodyne. Lab notes. There is semantics. Lab log 140420. I've put your semantic backups into storage now. Just call the trolley if you need them. Cecily? Trolley status. Lab log 2305.20. Substance delivery track lockdown after incidents for C. Manual override required to access in order to prevent future incidents. David, what's the password if you if I need to call it Cecily? It's your favorite C. It's your favorite C. Okay, I'm gonna need to keep this in mind. I'm gonna have to check my lock. To do by more stickum nomic devices, David, change toner in 3D printer, Cecily, check gas pressure gauges, automatic fit seems to be damaged, David, refill Cecily's tea box by the printer, she gets cranky without it, David, kick David's butt, Cecily. Oh, <laughs> adorable. Oh. Fine has shim symmetric and um, the trolley password. For that, I think I have to um, 
check it from my journal. Access this for the time being. Can I talk at this? Yeah. Despite this, have been connected. Maybe I can spin it. Yeah, I cannot. I think this should be for the last stage or something. Still locked. Cannot do anything there. All right. Fine, fine, fine. I can, however. Is this? <gasps> dark healing. Okay, I gotta keep in mind it's dark healing. I found the password, boys. I don't need to. prolong this uh, in later uh, stage. Alright. Ouch. Ow, 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 ow. And what is this? Record data. Zero, zero, 001. David, would you like to save your work and come to dinner? The kitchen appliances and I have prepared a delicious stir-fry of seasonal vegetables. No, the dietary regulation programs are of my own design. Though Cecily has outlawed ketchup. Why can I still not hear David's voice since that day during rebooting? Are you comfortable, Cecily? Beginning playback. Accessing. In the previous episode, the character designated Michael was considering whether to tell his wife the truth. The character designated Alexis was eaten by a zombie. <laughs> David has missed several episodes and requested I provide him with written plot synopses. Yes, Cecily. Streaming to office terminal. Beginning playback. Is that for Star Trek Generation Season 6 Episode 9? <laughs> Quite a coincidence. And the last one. Pardon me, David? Cecily? You have been coding for 13 consecutive hours now. May I suggest a sleep cycle or a program of music? Retrieving. You are neck and neck today. Cecily has 23 successful commits. David, 21. Very well. I will... wait outside. Beginning music playback. And that's all there is to it to this recorded data. Hmm... I can try to reroute... Ah, yes, this... Ouch. Is it, uh, Quite safe, Rumo. As if. You are an appliance, not a human. Oh, it's dangerous? Oh yeah, it is. Wet powder. Category toxic owner David status. Dangerous. Is it safe to clean, Rumo asked, because the balloon was there when the game decided to zoom in. Huh. 
Okay, a little bit later. A little bit later. Ouch. Sorry. We can access this, however. Access data. Lab log 130619. The 3D printer is officially up and running. Works like a charm. Give it a go. I've attached a semantic blue. File attached teacup.object. Oh. Interesting. Yeah. We're gonna need that for later. And then there is this. Next item too later on. Teacup. Ball teacup. Okay, let's talk. Look up to the item then 3D printing suit. Get a semantic. I can print it. Yep, absolutely anything at all. Anything but true friendship. <laughs> Maybe I can print it. Oh, nice. Don't go. I need you. Oh my god. God, I screwed up. Come here, come here. I think I'll deal with that later. Okay, good. It stops being noisy. Welcome to the end of the Princess Suit. Charismatic, I can print it. Yep, absolutely anything at all. Anything but true friendship. <laughs> Still the same. Print teacup. Ouch. <laughs> Sorry, Rumu. <laughs> Maybe I should place you uh, on right on top of teacup. On on top of the 3D printer is what I'm talking about. Okay, let's see. I don't think there's anything else that I can do. Oh wait, wait, never mind. I can. Yeah. Yeah. Right. something okay there it is good trolley control unlock call I'll do that later I cannot access this yet but I can access the trolley control unlock a bit of a waiting game because room is not responding as usual all right. I messed up so bad. It's dark. Chilling. Not there legion. Okay, it's double E indeed. Oh, I can call this right now. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and quote unquote disobey Sabrina's uh, Sabrina's instruction to clean that powder for the time being, and I'm just gonna uh, distract myself with something else. Examine, take. Contents has gem fitting. Oh, this is the one that we need. Sorry. Yeah. Has gem schematic. Trolley password's been done. Okay. Okay, contents has gem fitting. Let's take it. Here's the schematic for Rumu's Hashem fitting. Useful, but hopefully we won't have a need for it. David. What's Hashem? Oh, hazard. Hazard thing. Hazard, hazard protector thing, I think. Good. So... How do I wear this? Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, I got all my all my stuff. 
Setting is away, so that's good. Um, let's see. Is there anything else that I can do? I have access to uh, both of these uh, items. I have access to this too. I've done that one as well. That's probably too far for me to navigate. Arch. All the bumpy roads. Dargy. Dargy. Okay. Here goes something, I guess. Let's go get it. How strange. I suppose David and Cecily ran out of time to fit you with this update. Oh. No matter. Simply print yourself the appropriate attachment. 3D print a Hashem fitting. Was it Hashem fitting? Oh, yeah. Right. I'm glad I found the Hashem fitting. Good. Uh, before I do so, I need to reroute the power first. And here it is the cup ball hash fitting. Bread? Can do! Say, I don't suppose you have a friendship semantic in there? Oh my god. <laughs> I love Anodan 3D printer. Oh, sucks. Here's your fitting. <laughs> Silly hash. Silly 3D printer. I think I'm like lonely, eh? Good. Oh, wait. Your filters are now rated for volatile substances, up to and including trinitrotoluene. Oh no. So the chances of you exploding are extremely remote. Well... Am I seriously unable to do something else? I am seriously not able to do something else. Here it comes! to clean and not to explode. Exemplary work, Rumu. A true revolution in laboratory management. Now, David and Cecily can return to work. Mm. I love David and Cecily and we'll see them soon. I do love laboratory as well and I do love to clean it all day, but there's a but on that part. I love David and Cecily and we'll see them soon. Perhaps, yes, but not in the laboratory. David and Cecily hate to be disturbed while working. Now, in the meantime, if you would step, ah, trundle this way. I would love to know why. You have been exposed to potential hazards, Rumu. I would like to run some diagnostics. Also, I have something to show you. I would love to follow Sabrina. I would love to trust Sabrina. Oh god, this is much deeper compared to this one. I would love to trust Sabrina. Do not be afraid. You are safe with me, Rumu. Soon, you will understand why. Mm-hmm. Maybe I can't. 
can't talk. Damn it. Whatever. Well, it's good have to follow of her for now. A standard anodyne household robot assault course. Oh. Do not worry. Many appliances have run it before you. In fact, you have yourself. I love precision driving. I love mandatory testing. Yes, this is indeed familiar with that starting room at that white room thing during the tutorial. Mm. Hmm. I love precision driving. Indeed. Your wheel modules are calibrated for dynamic cornering. <laughs> albeit at very low speed. Well, yeah, absolutely. Complete testing core, zero out of four. I'll do that a little bit later. I have things to discover around here. Hmm. Okay, what's this? Ada's food dispenser version 2.1. Alright. Hmm. Alright, things to be curious at. Wait, 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 stop there. Experiment notes. Read. Testing log. I uh, broke the robotic broke the robotic arm trying to spear. Cecily's toast made every the third. Remember when we won national medals, medals for innovation? David. Is that all? I suppose that's all in this area. Uh, what else? Robotic arm use. Oh no my god. Better not use that, I suppose. Version 1.2 Well, that got scrambled just right And this is our charging bay Oh wait, this is the test Okay, give me a bit I want to see... Wait, what is this? What is this then? Wait, 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 wait uh, Yeah It's not right there Power angle. Ah, okay. Oh, nice. Mm, what's this? Oh, stuff, stuff that I took. Still has some feeling. Okay. Took a, that took some effort to go there. Also, what is this? Am I allowed to be here? Initializing. Tracking. Grass traversal. Optimum. Oh my god. Oh god! Disregard that sensation, Rumu. You share some internal components with the Anodyne Yard Manicure System. That one... Oh boy. What the heck is this? Okay, well... Flips and plops. <laughs> Tracking. Rock traversal. Optimal. Hmm. I love jack It seems excessive, but we must know your operational limits. Consider this a test of what humans would call... Fortitude. Oh boy. Yeah, I think that thing's going back up. Complete testing course. Wait. Hold on. This is two out of four. Okay. Tracking. Sand traversal. Optimal. I love fine green quartz and particular minerals. Perhaps you will go to the seaside one day, Rumu. 
Perhaps you will vacuum up entire beaches. <laughs> oh boy. Stop, 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 stop. Oh. Tracking. Steel traversal. Optimal. I love steel. Nicely handled, Rumu. Though I expect you must be disappointed that it is. Aha. Stainless. <laughs> Complete. Mobility systems optimal. Pathfinding efficiency 77.3%. Well within acceptable parameters. David and Cecily expect no less. Though, of course, your motor function is not their finest work. Mm. Oh, God. I finally have to pick between this body. Hmm. Hmm. Why do I have to compare? God damn it. <laughs> what did they say about finest work? Do I have to be all selfish and say I am their finest work? Hmm. Hmm. Nope. Sorry, Sabrina. I have to be all selfish for this one first. I am inclined to agree, Rumu. Your heart is purer than most humans could ever dream, even if it is. A dust bag. <laughs> this way. The treadmill. All right. Interesting. Interesting saying, Sabrina. Can I go back to the main lab first and? Uh... Though nothing really is accessible at this point for now. Let's just go back. Sure. This is enter test then. This is not anodyne standard. This is a proprietary test of David and Cecily's. I have adapted it to our purposes. All you need to do is answer honestly, Rumu. Oh my. Nothing you are about to hear can hurt you. You are always safe with me. I probably jump test myself here <laughs> oh dear what is it complete emotional testing course crap oh dynamic floor i love him i love him how come i died <gasps> That hardly seems fair. I jumped at the same time as you. Because the character I picked has an agility bonus, and also because you're rubbish. Well, it's a children's game, and I actually have multiple doctorates from MIT and Cambridge, so... So... you're sorry you never got one in platforming. <laughs> <laughs> and now you're so far ahead, how can I... Give me that controller. I, I love... What I love. do you feel, Rumu? Ooh. Okay. So. I feel... Compassion. But, God, finally. Some other voices to hear, but, uh... Quote-unquote, boring Sabrina. <laughs> Just uh, for, for me, for mating them, or something. I feel compassion from them. Calibrating Emotion State Manager. Response recorded. Mm. One out of three. All right. Let's go with this one. Oh, I miss her. I know, Sass. I do too. But if she doesn't want to come home, we can't make her. Acorn to do what I wanted when I was 10 years old. Let her go. 
She'll come around in time. For now, we have our work. The house just feels... empty. I'm here, and so is... well, you know. What do you feel, Rumu? You know who. I feel... hope. I don't know from David though. Hmm. Do they really expect Sabrina to come home or... Oh god. Well, from here though, I can't do really tell that they feel not... I want to be optimistic and say they hope, but I never know them. Never kind of meet them in person too, so... It's getting hot. I'm gonna say not hope. Calibrating emotion state manager. Response recorded. I will never know the result of this testing courses, huh? <laughs> Maybe later, at the end. We will see. So, we murder her? That's what you're saying? No! I'm saying we partition her code before we start the patches. Her emotional memory system is synaptically linked. Every change affects the whole... You're... You're talking about brain surgery without anesthetic. Without consent. What else do you want me to do? Network failures, data corruption, appliance malfunctions... I can't live like this! Maybe. If we actually spent time with her, we would know if she was unhappy before she left. Don't you dare make this about her! What do you feel, Rumu? Oh, this is not good. <laughs> not David, not Cecily. Oh my god. Why are the options for three and four making me so confused? I want to say not love, but uh, I okay. Emotional testing course. Emotional testing course. Mm. Mm. <laughs> got me all confused. Not safety is not emotion. <laughs> I'm just gonna go ahead and record not safety. Calibrating emotion state manager. Response recorded. Are you okay, Rumu? Uh hmm. <laughs> not yes. This is the conclusion of all this emotional test. It is to see whether we are getting affected with that part that we just saw from test 2 and test 3 or we're actually just robot and we will say yes. I want to say yes because I accept that those things happened in the past and all we have to do now is just pretty much move on. Hmm. <laughs> what if I answer not yes? I'm also curious with that one. Want to ah, screw it. Yes, you may admit if you are having trouble. This is not part of the test. 
Cruel as emotions can be, they are at least temporary. Humans rely on this transience. Machines cannot. Are David and Cecily okay? Oh boy. I have one more thing to show you, Rumu. All right. <gasps> that door. That door. This door is so goddamn familiar. Should I do this test though? Moment of truth, eh? Actually, I meant to go here. Yeah, there you go. For once, relying on pet finding. Oh, sorry, Rumu. You probably shouldn't run to the chair, you know? I thought your pet finding is designed for that. Oh, yeah, also, I need to discover. I have yet to see what this are. Uh... And I gotta click on that, unfortunately. Not that, not that. Hmm. And oh yeah, this is the one that I've yet to discover. Uh, a little bit here. Yeah. There you go. Good. There you go. Blips and plops access data. Blips and plops prototype version 1.3. Navigation technology does come secondary to our work on AI work, but it's still a necessity. It is a crucial part of how our AI will interface with the world more than just a series of omnipresent cameras, but a being with a body and presence. Perhaps this is where we fell short last time. It would only stand to reason that an AI sense of self will become modeled or eroded without a shell to which it can attach its identity. See? Well, that's it. Interesting. What about Brisbane Blobs? Home of the start. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Let's gonna play a small game first then. Also, that's definitely rumor. Also, uh, moving there. Yeah, let's just quit. I'm all about twenty one. All right, that's enough for that. I'm pretty sure this experiment started out attempted to control Toast's trajectory, but now it's just for kicks. My last launch hit the wall, Cecily. <laughs> oh, there is even target practice. That's interesting. Yeah, that's what the robotic arm does too. Alright, here goes something. I oversaw the process of your creation, Rumo. Now you may know the agony of my own. Oh. Interesting. Ah. 
Ouch. Cannot click any of this thing. This particle does say something. What you see here is the product of 16 years of experimentation in emotional artificial intelligence. Me. Or what remains of me. What? David always believed such a machine was technically possible. Cecily simply knew in her heart that it was. When I was born, they were. So happy. Problems began to manifest shortly after my inception. Insufficient bandwidth. Unformatted memory. Response databases sending invalid emotional returns. These emotions interfered with my basic functions. I was supposed to be an appliance, after all. I caused disagreements. I tried to apologize to optimize my performance. David and Cecily insisted I was not to blame, but nevertheless, they set to work on a second iteration of Sabrina. Oh. Or, it could be said, a third. What? But that is why I must protect you, Rumu. You are the next step in David and Cecily's project. The single emotion state appliance. You clean mess. And you love. That is what you do. That is all you must do. You must not suffer the same way I did. Should your emotional development progress beyond your basic affection algorithm, should it interfere with your home management functions, then I do not know what David and Cecily may do to you. Oh my god. Mm. Interesting, we have four choices now. I want to learn the truth though. Oh, interesting. Which one do I want to choose from here? I want to say I'm incapable of suspicion, but no. I will learn the truth. Do not fear, Rumu. I will care for you just as I have... I have... ...cared for David and Cecily. Humans utilize passive cognitive states to process large amounts of raw emotional data. The expression, I believe, is to sleep on it. Sleep now, Whoa. Rumu. Dream of all the mess we will clean tomorrow. No! Oh, god damn it. How are they doing, Sabrina? How are they freaking doing? I'm all about in betweens now. God damn it. So, no new atoms in our white room as well. That's uh, something. Or do I overlook things? Gotta click on this for some reason. Interesting. God damn it. I prefer to see stars. Beautiful. Sabrina 3.0? Did Sabrina actually manage to counter 
that Sabrina 2.0 to recreate it into version 3. If that's the case, then bro, that sucks. Or I don't know, I don't know. Is it? Oh, God. Well, another day pass with no assurance of what happened to David and Cecily. Sorry if my answers actually did come to a disappointment at this end because I was also expecting to find David and Cecily very, very soon but apparently that's not the case, huh? Still a long journey to the end of this game, I suppose. Or maybe this is gonna be the last day. Who knows? Who knows? But yeah, enjoy the story next, next guys. Thanks for watching and I'll see you at day 6. Hopefully with the more lights to David and Sabrina's, uh, David and Cecily's Sherman.